Okay, so today's great dollar find. Uh, dollar box find here. Marvel 2 and 1 Annual number 7 from 1982. I remember picking this up off the rack as a kid. And uh, this is the first uh, Power Stone and first champion. Um, an elder of the universe, I believe. So anyway, uh, just some minor creases, minor cover creases there. You can see that. I really believe, I mean, they're, they're not minor in length, but I think they're minor in depth. There's, there's no color break. And I think it's going to press out really nicely. So uh, I'm going to press this. And um, this is one for my collection because I always loved this story. It wasn't crazy about the Ron Wilson art, uh, but I did like the story. And let's see who wrote that story, by the way. I don't remember who wrote that story. But it's uh, just a great story that kind of highlighted the, um, let's see here, Tom DeFalco. Tom DeFalco script, Ron Wilson, Ron Wilson pencils. Uh, this is just one of those stories that really highlighted the um, superior, I don't know, what do you call it, uh, spirit of the thing as a hero. And um, anyway, just a great, great story. So we're going to press that, and I think it's going to look a lot, lot better. All right, I did it for about 16 minutes at 165. Didn't even go up to 175. And it did a, did a pretty good job on those creases. And uh, I'm really, I'm happy with it. I'll do it, I'll do it once more uh, with probably a little more pressure and a little more heat. But uh, I'm just happy to have this book again because this has been a tough one to find. I like the dollar boxes. And this has been a tough one to find <clears throat> in high grade um, in the cheap boxes. So, glad to have me another Marvel 2-in-1 Annual Number 7. Uh, the first appearance of the Champion and the Power Stone.